I take it we're heading through here, then? Everything all right, Zephyr? Yeah, it's nothing. What is that? A ring? It was my wife's. Your wife? You never mention anything about being married. That's surprising. You said was. So then, is she gone? Was it the Renans? No, she was sick. I couldn't get her the medicine she needed, and then she was gone. I'd always wanted to show her the world as it could be. I'm sorry. Don't be. There are plenty of people out there more deserving of your sympathy than me. But, but... Uh, uh. Let's go. Was almost too easy. This one's tough, but we have no choice. Let me know if you need healing. You're finished. I'll run you through. Here I come. You're finished. Take right. aim and blast it out of the sun. Take this. You got no. flyers. I've got this. All yours! You're finished! I'll run you through! Rising Wyvern! Touch cannon! One final push! Right! Give them all we got! Imagine there were Zoogles out there that could pretend to be statues. That's because Zoogles don't come from nature. Who knows what else is lurking out there? It's freezing in here. And after how hot it was outside, too. It must be the cold air sweeping in from Cislodia. It's the polar opposite of Calaglia, so I'd get used to it if I were you. Is the little guy okay? Oh, don't worry about Hoodle. He's from Cislodia. Probably just nerves is all. He's not really used to being around other people this much. Rinwell, how about filling them in on what to expect from Cislodia? Oh, yeah. Hmm, let's see. Well, for starters, nobody trusts nobody. Come again? Just like I said, you never know when snake eyes are watching you. That's what they call their lord's henchmen, apparently. Their official title is the Bureau of Civil Observation. They've got cronies undercover everywhere, observing us at all times. So? Renin surveillance was an everyday part of life in Calaglia. Difference is, in Cislodia, it's not just Renins. They've got Danon spying on each other, too.
Or in other words, there's the Snake Eyes themselves, plus all their small-time informants. All it takes is someone squealing on you, and it's straight to labor camp. No questions asked, no goodbyes. Of course, informers are rewarded handsomely for their deceit. Everyone's always got one eye open, waiting for the moment to inform on someone before being tattled on first. Hence the not trusting one another, huh? In that case, what do you think they'll make of us? Hard to say. Although, not being from Cislodia will probably help, honestly. More trustful of outsiders than even your own people. Why go along with it, though? Why doesn't anyone take a stand? Not everyone is strong enough to stand, Alfin. <laughs> That's why the world needs people like us. Blazing sword, okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. What is this place anyway? What's with these columns and steps? No idea. I've never been here before either. Rena's convoy squads probably used it in the past. I guess it's definitely seen better days. You wouldn't know anything, would you, Xion? Nope. And I'm not interested in learning either. <sighs> Actually, these are Danon ruins. See, you can tell by the way the columns are decorated and stuff. They're all old Danon designs. Are you saying these things were built more than 300 years ago then? Yeah. I have no idea what they were used for though. It's amazing to think our ancestors were capable of making such structures. Hopefully there'll come a time when us Danons will be able to walk through here freely again. That's exactly what you're fighting for, isn't it? Let's keep moving. Yeah. Right. I'm sure I can put this to use. Don't get careless! You're mine! Don't tell me! I never miss! Huh? Right Tearing the flame! Reloading! Huh? Talon's Fury! Burning! Eternal Torrent! Slice! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! See you continue on in that game. Uh, yes, my lady? Something you wanted to say? That was almost too easy. Take it! 
Ignite! Gemini Here I come! Oh, it's over! Try the Talon Storm! Infernal Storm! Let's do it! Chill! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! See you continue on in that vein. Uh, yes, my lady? Something you wanted to oh, say? Well, take a look at that. Break yourself! This one's tough! Here I go! Demon Fang! You're mine! Strike! Strike shot! This is in the sky! Strike. You're mine! Rising oh, Warriors! You're way more than saving for me! I was overconfident. Shield! I can feel my power growing! Struggling.
Upward. Don't get careless. You're mine. Don't tell me. Yeah, what you do? Damn it. What's wrong? Nothing. Focus on the fight. Over. Some power you wield. You're the one who did the heavy lifting. on the ropes. Don't forget to heal your wounds. And what have we got here? Oh! I saw that in a book once. Those things are worth a lot. You're a little bookworm, aren't you? <laughs> to me. Not much further now. The exit will take us straight into Cislodia. <sighs> You're brooding again. What's eating at you? We defeated Balsif and liberated Calaglia from the Renans. Now, we're on our way to rescue our fellow Danans in Cislodia. I'm committed to helping our people. You know that. But then, what happens after that? What's our endgame here? Good question. The Danans vastly outnumber the Renans, yet we rarely take up arms because we know that when it comes to firepower, we don't stand a chance. Even if you succeeded in overthrowing the Lords and freeing Dana, then what? 
Lenigus would still hover over us, the Renan motherland behind it. If they so desired, the Renans could potentially use their might to wipe us off the planet in a second, no matter how powerful that blazing sword of yours is. So what you're saying is we don't stand a chance. So what the heck are we even doing? There's no sense in discarding today's victory for tomorrow's loss. If fighting yields even a single day of freedom, it will all have been worth it in the end. Who knows? Maybe that's the day we make preparations for the battle that will free us for good. Speaking pragmatically, the fact the Renans don't exterminate us all in spite of their technical advantage has to mean one thing. They need us. It's up to us to put a dent in their armor before they cotton on to our plan. That way, we force them to the negotiating table. You want to negotiate with the Renans? It's galling, I know. But it's the only way to survive while securing our freedom at the same time. Th that's But even so, we can't just... If you lot are done talking, there's a lord we came to overthrow. What about you, Xion? What do you plan on doing after we've given the lords the boot? All I know is, my reasons for fighting aren't the same as yours. I'm through answering these pointless questions. So this is Cislodia. How far is it to the capital? We've still got a ways to go. Also, the Zoogles here are different than those in Calaglia, so be careful. Got it. Sounds like we should make sure we stick close together as we keep moving. Agreed. Uh, hey, Xion! It'll be hard for me to use my rifle in a pinch if we're all bunched together. I'll follow behind the rest of you. Right. Makes sense. What's up with her? She seems even more upfront than back in Calaglia. In case you forgot, we're in enemy territory now. If you don't get serious and focus on the task at hand, you'll be inviting trouble. Hmm. Don't take it personally. I think that's just the way she is. Plus, you have to remember, with those thorns of hers, she's probably not used to anybody being all that friendly to her. The fact that you can't feel pain means you probably end up getting closer to her than she's used to. You really think so? We're talking about someone who came down to Dana all by herself. But you don't see her homesick for Lenigus at all, do you? No. That alone speaks volumes about how difficult her whole situation must be. Yeah. It's your job as her partner to understand that and give her the support she needs. You two are going to be stuck together for a while. So, the sooner you make nice, the better. Make nice? Yep. Now come on. I get that they're not exactly on the best of terms, but... Is everything going to be okay with these people? I don't pick on the weak. You're mine! Steering! Huh? 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 Steering! 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 the Zoogles here are a lot different from what we're used to back in Calaglia. It's because this realm is so cold. I imagine they had to be adapted to fit the climate. 
Meaning if we hit them with fire arts, it should be extra effective against them. We're so high up! Rinwell, don't go too far ahead. You never know where Zoogles might be lurking. Oh, we'll be fine. We've been able to handle them up until now. Still, better that you hang back a bit. No way! I'm the one who asked you to come here in the first place, remember? Yeah, but if we lose you, we won't know where to go. Besides, it's old guys like me who should be sticking their necks out first. But... We need you in order to get in contact with the Resistance in Cislodia. So stick close until we find them, okay? Okay. Thanks. Now you've got me wondering. How'd you make it to Calaglia in the first place? I find it hard to imagine you didn't run into Zoogles along the way. <sighs> Are you good at hiding or something? Uh... yeah, that's it. I'm just really good at staying out of sight. Wow. Still, you had to have been pretty lucky to have made it the whole way unscathed. Lucky indeed. It's crazy to feel just how much the temperature has changed from crossing over a single peak. Is it really that big of a difference? Definitely. Calaglia was hot. I can only tell from appearance, so... Uh, uh, achoo! You might not be able to feel it, but it sure looks like your body responds to it just the same. Sibs like it. So if I sneeze, I guess that it's a sign that it's getting chilly. They say that sneezing is often the first sign you're coming down with the cold, too. That's all the more reason you need to be careful with... Was that also a sneeze? I just bit my tongue, that's all. No, it sounded a lot different from mine, but I could swear it was still... It wasn't a sneeze, okay? <laughs> Guess we both need to be careful out here in the cold. <sighs> Is it hard leaving Calaglia behind? No. Actually, it's kind of a relief to be away from there. Really? What makes you say that? Because it was getting to the point where every man, woman, and child would come up and talk to me like they knew me. I could barely find a moment to breathe, let alone relax. Well, what you did was kind of a big deal, you know. You overthrew a Renan Lord and burst open the gates of fire. Yeah, but that was only because I had the Blazing Sword with me. We wouldn't have made it to Balsef without you and the Crimson Crow, Zephyr. Well, maybe so. But you're still the one who took him out in the end. It's only natural for people to look up to those who protect them. You're a hero to those people. I never asked to be one. I... I never asked to take the place of a lord in people's minds. I don't want it. You're a strange one, Alfin. That's for sure. <laughs> If that's how you really feel, then hold on to that. Listen to those thoughts when you feel lost and don't know what to do. If you can do that, you won't lose sight of who you are, or what the right path to take is. The right path to take, huh? What's this thing? I'll take you all on! Take it! Flame I'm on it! You're finished! Burning? See ya! Talent sword! Demon Pain! You're mine! Uh, Rock and ready! Demon Pain! This. this one's mine! Uh, and it's coming! Uh, Talon Storm! You're mine! Do it. And it's Demon Pain! I owe you one! Pathetic! Break 
yourselves. This one's tough. Hey, You're surrounded. Burning Just stay burning. calm. Like this. Inferno turret. Here I go. I'll run Let you go. Finish this. You're finished. Try this. Inferno turret. I'm Here I come. Help. Here I come. I'm I'm getting getting Here General I come. Help. We turned the tables on him. There are still more left. Right. No time to hold back. Reload! You picked the wrong time. Take this, Anders! I'm out of it's ammo. Over. I'm all stopped up. Try this. I'm on it. It's do it. Do it. Do it. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. That's some power you wield. You're the one who did the heavy lifting. What's this thing? I won't forgive you! Swallow blade! Try this! Inferno Torrent! Take strike! Go. It's Demon Fang! I'm on it! Airborne beast! You're mine! My set! Rising Wyvern! Strike! We've got flyers! I've got this! Let a marksman handle it! All yours! Take this! Demon Fang! Do it! Rising Wyvern! Do it! Do it! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Together, that wasn't even a problem. Brace yourselves! This one's tough! Try this! Don't go charging off like that! Here I come! Storm! Uh, Inferno Torrent! Hear me! Flame I'm not Fury. done! Burning strike! Come on! I'm not done! You're mine! Power it's over! Not half try bad. This. Could you try Inferno to be less Torrent. patronizing? I didn't mean Storm nothing by it. Take this! It's, it's over! I'm ready! Demon Fang! This one's mine! No escape! Rising Wyvern! Sighted! You're on! You're on. mine! Slut. You're mine! Do it! Still. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! We're in good form! Another notch in the old belt. Keep them coming. You like that taste of freedom, kid? Huh. <laughs> I think I could get used to it. Would you like to warm up some? Aren't there people in there? You should let yourself unwind when you get the chance. I guess there's no arguing with that. Hey. Mm-hmm. Thank you. 
Hmm? Right. Mm-hmm. Happy now, Shion? Yeah, I'd say so. She better be, after all she ate. I stopped before I was full, though. What? Okay, off we go. Give you. 
I never You're miss. surrounded. Just stay calm. Here I come. Come on, Blade. Try this. Tell him. Get my Touch it. It's over. You're mine. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> How's this? I'm only See ya. Take the hell in store. Reload. It's over. Uh, it's burn time. I can't stop that. Here I come. Hell in store. You're finished. Do it. Still. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. I can feel my power growing! This one's tough! I never miss! You're finished! Searing oh, You're mine! Reload! Tell him, Storm! Touch the power of water! Strike! Oh, what you do? Strike! Got it! Oh, oh, this is tough! Here's the healing arc! Touch first aid! Okay, here I go! Here I come! I'll run you through! You're finished! Tell him, Storm! Strike! Burning? Inferno turret! The target is sealed! Demon Fang! Here I come! Steering You're finished! Uh, I'm out! Here I come! What You're finished! Sweet. Demon Fang! One mine. final push! Run! Right. Give him all we got! These little ones are hardly worth our time. Less talking, more power. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! I can feel my precision improving. I need something to eat. I won't forgive you! Not today! I'll run you through! Had it coming! Inferno Torrent! Here I come! See ya! Try to Inferno Torrent! I owe you one! This one's mine! Take this! I'll run you through! Uh, it's over! Oh. Take this! Touch Do it! It's over! Still! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Another notch in the old belt. Keep them coming. You like that taste of freedom, kid? Huh. <laughs> I think I could get used to it. Houses in a place like this. People really live all the way out here? The whole area is just little villages. This one's Messia 224. Wait, I hear something. Sounds like people arguing. Bureau agents. The Snake Eyes must be here. We should sneak past them. That was my original plan, since you all stick out so much. Why? In case one of your people tattles on us? It's the Renans who are making us do it. Oh yeah? Like this Renan who you need to save your people's skin? Well, that's rich, coming from the Bright Eyes whose people are the reason we're in this mess in the that's first enough. place! But she started it! Three centuries of resentment is too much to lay at a single person's feet. Same goes for you, Xion. You can't ignore the past when speaking of the present. Now, what's going on in that village? 
If I were to guess, someone tipped off the Snake Eyes and they're here to make an arrest. You'd better not be about to suggest we get involved. I'm here for the Lord's Head, and nothing more. That go for you too, Alfin? Why did you come? Why? To liberate this realm's slaves, of course. Are you still a slave? Me? No. Then tell me what it means to live unshackled. I'll tell you what it means. It means living on your own terms. Being your own master. Thinking and making decisions for yourself. And being prepared to accept the consequences. Understand? Yeah, I think so. Good. So prove it to me. Shion. Don't start with me. I'm not going, and that's that. I understand. Just wait here with Rinwell till we get back, okay? You're going in without the sword? Looks to be that way. This is my choice, after all. Your choice? Ugh, listen to yourself. That sword's useless to me without someone to use it. You go dying on me out there and you'll put our whole mission in jeopardy. But I need us all to make it safely to Sislodan. Too many sacrifices have already been made. We came here to put a stop to any more. You've... You've sacrificed something too, huh? Hide somewhere until it's over. You hear me? Damn those Renans. I hate seeing Ganon suffering under them here, too. I'm surprised you're so angry about it. You're not even from here. It doesn't matter where I'm from. Enough is enough with these people. Silence embedded. Anyone who fails to cooperate will be arrested and tried as a traitor to the realm. <sighs> Damn it. Some rat must have sold us out again. You there! You want me to haul you up on suspicion of civil disobedience? But, but I didn't! Ah! What? Leave him alone! An embedded dares to find the orders of his lordship! Know your place, slave! We can't use the Blazing Sword this close to the villagers. They could get hurt. But there are too many agents. Zephyr? Law? Is that you? <laughs> What's going on? Aren't we supposed to be fighting them? You're alive. What are you doing here? The realm of Cislodia doesn't tolerate civil dissidents like you. Law. I hereby detain you in the name of his lordship! Zephyr? What the hell? Zephyr! Here they come! Take away! I'm going in! Engaging!
What's going on, Zephyr? Why won't you fight him? Is that soldier someone you know? Don't hurt him. Huh? What are you- Please. It won't work, you know. You never change, do you? You've always got this damn knowing look on your face! Zephyr! I got it handled. But he just... He's my son. So now you remember me. The nerve of you. I'm gonna wipe that damn look off your face once and for all! What in hell? Rinwell, you. Law. Watch yourselves! The insurgents are armed! Enemy reinforcements! Use the sword! I can't! The villagers will get caught in the blast! We need to fall back! Oh, for crying out loud! <laughs> Suffer! Go! Leave without me! You can't! I'm not leaving without him! There's no time! But what about the resistance? Everyone's counting on you! Forgive me. Ugh. We've waited all night, but nobody's shown up. No sign of Zephyr or an enemy pursuit. So, what's the plan now? You really need to ask? We go rescue Zephyr. If he's under arrest, they'll have taken him to Sisloden, the capital city. Assuming he's still alive, that is. I can't believe Zephyr never told us he had a son. I wonder if the rest of the Crimson Crows knew about it. And to find him in that village of all places. Some coincidence, huh? Those fireworks you pulled out of your hat back there. They were astral arts, weren't they? Shion, what the hell are you Except doing? Except I've never heard of a Danon who can cast astral arts. Are you a Renan? Like hell I am! No, of course not. Renan's eyes light up when they use astral arts. And when you used an art, your eyes definitely didn't. So I guess that means you can't be a so-called Bright Eyes after all. Sorry. You're right. Those were astral arts I used. Same as the ones wielded by the Renans. A long time ago, my family... My people were once known as mages. A Danon mage? Up until now, I'd only ever heard of them in stories and rumors. Though now I've seen one with my own eyes, I suppose I'll have to believe it. We've been in hiding for a long, long time. Even before the Renans first attacked. That's why no one knew about us. Even before the Renans? Yeah. My ancestors were persecuted and targeted for their gifts. But it was by their fellow Danans. They lived hidden away all these centuries, keeping their existence secret even from the Resistance. My mom and dad drilled it into me that I was never, under any circumstances, supposed to let anyone find out about us. If that's the case, then why did you use your powers back there? I don't know. One second I saw Zephyr about to be killed, and the next I was...
Dana and Astral Arts. If the Renans knew such a threat existed, there'd be hell to pay. Hey. What? You think I'm gonna go to the Lords with this information? I'm a traitor and an outcast at this point. Or did you forget? What amazes me is how anyone could have that kind of power and yet keep it hidden all this time. Didn't you ever want to use it to help your people? Don't talk like you know the first thing about me, Renan! That's enough. Zephyr wouldn't want this. Listen, all I care about is taking out the Lords, okay? Which is no doubt what her people want too. Using her powers to help do it only makes sense. Makes sense for who? Us? Besides, Zephyr comes first. We can't just abandon him. It's fine. Huh? You're going to save Zephyr, right? If so, you're going to need my powers to do it. I don't want anyone else to die. Are you sure? Then let's get back to the village. We need to find out what happened. <laughs>